Hello. Welcome to Corona video. <laughs> I thought it'd be good to document our little life for the while. So we were going to do it as a family thing, but Zach and Maisie didn't want to join, so it'll just be us two, I'm afraid. Yeah, um, that's that's how it is. We are. Uh, we, I, I want to say we we're officially locked in, but we aren't, are we? Because you mm. are um, kind of work. You work for school, which means that you're only going in for like one day a week now, two days a week one occasionally. Or two days. I work for a youth organisation that primarily works in schools, which means that a lot of that isn't happening anymore. And so we're trying to negotiate how we do that effectively, like engage with young people, but mainly online. Uh, so there's going to be a lot of these videos, not only for us, but also uh, with the charity over on Youth of Christ. So you can check those out on YouTube. Um, but yeah, we just figured we'd document like on a daily, almost ish kind of basis how we doing. If any of us get ill, then we can you can watch that and see how we cope with being ill, uh, which will be a great video to watch. Um, <laughs> um, uh, although we won't be able to be in the same room, which will be awkward. Uh, so um, yeah, so. This is day one of kind of trying to stay in the house and failing miserably. <laughs> but, uh, we did uh, it all safe. So what did we do today? We went and walked our dog for an hour and a bit yep. along the greenway. And yep. there were loads of other dogs, but we kept our social distance. Yeah. Um, and we had a coffee out of our flask, so it was good. I have a question. Yeah. If you walk your dog and lots of other people go, oh, what a great dog, and stroke it and they're infected and then you stroke your dog or pick him up to put back in the car is that like a really obvious easy because social distancing is like saying it, it, it's social distancing but here's this thing that we can all touch as we walk past it <laughs> so I, don't, I don't i don't know whether that counts yeah. anyway, i guess so as long as you wash your hands all the, wash your hands all the time see. then you should be okay it's yeah. just just a weird one to work to make yourself drink not me Hey ho. You didn't ask um, me. Challenges for oh, today. Oh, you saw me making the drinks and you didn't go, oh, can I have one, please? Your challenge for today. What? Have you had any, what's your challenge been? What have you found tricky today? Um, well, nothing really, because it's Saturday, so it's kind of, we often have quite a lazy day on a Saturday, so it's kind of just been, I think, what's going to be weird is when I, I get to like Monday or Tuesday and I'm trying to do my, my daily work stuff and the whole family are in the house and it's just a bit weird and then also for me I know that I get cabin fever really easily so maybe having family here will ease that or frustrate me but certainly just like once a day just getting out even just to go and grab McDonald's coffee or something just to be out of the house still working but just in a different environment I think you talk a lot really helps. when there's a camera in front of you no but that's the truth okay you just say it's taking a long time um, my challenge for today I'm a doer and I like to do things so my challenge for today was not doing too much because if I do too much today I'll be bored tomorrow yeah so I've tried to just do a little bit today. Can um, I just say, you will never get bored. There is always stuff that well, you have to do. We don't know. It's going to be a long, long. But there's time. always stuff that you. I mean, can you imagine the day when there's nothing left to do on the house? Might come. <laughs> Whatever. Anyway, so. Um, um, yeah, we're not going to waffle on for too long. What are you going to do? Correct. What are you going to do in terms of um, like? And you, we talked about like picking something to learn or to do while over this period. Um, that's different than you wouldn't normally get a chance to do. So I'm going to do more sewing and maybe try and learn to play the whatever it is. The whatever it is. The wow. Of, the musical instrument that's upstairs. French horn? Tenor horn. Tenor horn. Tenor horn. Yeah. We will see. I might run out of puff. You did say that you would learn to do that when our kids left home or when you retired. I know. Or well, something. I've got more time now. So that would be really cool. Then we can play the band together. Ba, 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 ba. You clearly have no idea what. A child said is. to me at school yesterday, Mrs. Mills, you have a double chin. Right, and I'm, gonna, and I'm gonna, oh, and I'm gonna, um, we've got to make these shorts, okay. short and snappy. And I'm, I'm gonna potentially re pick up the mandolin and learn how to play that because I've started ages ago and then kind of gave up because I've got a mandolin. I'm gonna learn to play that a little bit. Indeed, I'm hoping the hairdressers won't shut because my roots are already a little bit no. quite bad. Oh, are you not naturally blonde? <gasps> wow, right, we'll see you tomorrow. Bye, bye.